What's up, guys? Welcome to a, another Tuesday evening drive. This one's a little different. I'm trying something new. It is the new YouTube capture app. I think that's what it's called. But I just just found out about it. Oh, you can see my glove. Leather gloves. Leather. <laughs> my friend just showed me a Saturday Night Live skit. This leather thing. It's pretty funny. Um, anyway, I throw these leather gloves on when I get in the car when it's freezing. And it's kind of warm inside, so ain't too shabby. But I'm trying out this YouTube app where you can record video and boom, put it straight on YouTube. So that's what I'm doing. Um, and it looks like I can do 720p. I tried before just recording a video with the with the iPhone camera app and, uh, you know, just uploading it from there, but it wasn't doing the 720. So, yeah. So hopefully this turns out pretty good. I think I can throw in, um, you know, make a title, description, all that kind of stuff. So that'll be kind of cool because, um, you know, I don't have a lot of time on Tuesday nights. Um, I get out of work at 5, and then at 7 I got this thing, you know, my friend's thing that I go to. That usually takes up the rest of the night, so I don't, really don't have much time to, you know, import the video and export and upload and all that kind of stuff. So, um, this could be a good solution for us. Oh, I just noticed this, <laughs> this calculates the time in seconds, so we're at like 119, 120 seconds. So, I gotta do math in my head. I gotta divide everything by 60 to know how many minutes we're at. Um, I wonder if there's a limit, by the way. We'll find out. Okay. But anyway, hopefully this, this will be a good solution. I don't have to import, export, upload, all that kind of stuff. I can just upload it straight from my phone, which would be great. So, um, first thing, I just wanted to um, tell you guys check out my actual channel, check out my new background if you haven't seen it yet. It was created by Terrace HD, and um, he's got his own YouTube channel, so check it out. Really, really nice guy. I think he's kind of a younger guy, he's still in school, you know, do, um, he was in school for design, but really nice guy, funny vids, he did an animation of my brother. And, um, you know, on Twitter, he's throwing up some sneak peeks of an animation he's doing for the B team, a 3D Minecraft animation. And he's got some skills, guys. So go check him out. Um, yeah, I'll real quick, talk about my day. Um, not much to say. It was pretty slow. Possibly the slowest day I've had ever. Um, but one eventful part of the day was I managed to jam up our sewing machine. <laughs> that's that's one of the things. I don't, I don't tell you guys what my job is. I like to keep it private for now. But one of the things I gotta do is sew. It's just, it's a random thing. I'm not like a seamstress or anything. I'm in the medical field. But, um, but I jammed up our sewing machine and I spent a lot of the day just like looking up to Torres. Oh, there's a there's a police car. Good thing I'm going the speed limit. Go to the speed limit. Buckle up. Uh, I think it's okay to record videos. Anyway. Um, yeah, so jammed up the sewing machine, looking up things, and couldn't figure it out. Other than that, not too eventful of a day. So, let's get into the questions. So, if you, I, I think I say this every week now. If you don't know what's going on, follow me on Twitter if you don't. Every Tuesday, send out a tweet, what you want me to talk about, boom, you tell me, I do it. So, C.W. Sterling said, um, how did the exam go? That was very considerate. 
you know, it's considerate to talk to people. This is a little social tip, which you probably heard before. It's considerate to talk to people about their life. Ask them things about their life. If they tell you something that's going to happen, do a follow-up question afterwards and ask how it went. It really means a lot to people. Just like C.W. Sterling did. Uh, but yeah, I appreciate that. Thanks for asking about the exam. Uh, it went pretty well. You know, I went to Florida in my... Uh, I got a Minecraft fan server video coming up. And I talk all about it. I talk all about the flight, the exam, and everything. Um, so stay tuned for that. But, um, overall, it went well. I think I passed. It was, it was a pretty... It's a pretty involved process, about five hours. Um, all hands-on stuff, working with, you know, they they create um, real-life situations that you have to, you know, handle them the way you would, clinically, that kind of thing. So, it was good. Um, Webster Matty on Twitter said... Ooh, getting out of here. She didn't say that. No, she said, do I have any uh, holiday traditions or anything? And I really don't. Like, for, for Thanksgiving, we usually go visit our family um, near the Kalamazoo area. But for Christmas, we usually just hang out with our family, just our immediate family. This year we'll have a little addition. One of my one of my coworkers, he was a uh, resident too. He um, he's from Texas, so he's up here all by himself doing this stuff. And you know he doesn't um, you know he's not gonna be with his family. So you know he joined us for Thanksgiving. I talked to my family. They said it'd be okay for him to join us for Christmas. So it'll be nice. You know. He, he really liked hanging out with our family, and um, so he's looking forward to Christmas. But I ain't getting him any presents. <laughs> I don't know, just kidding. Maybe I'll get him a present or something. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, so now I don't have, to answer your question, I don't have many, you know, traditions with Christmas, but I'd like to start some kind of tradition with the channel. I want to figure out something fun to do with you guys. Maybe, maybe, uh, I don't know, live stream some video games. Like, I know I haven't set that up, but maybe I can nail that down soon. Or, you know, maybe just play, play some Call of Duty with you guys. I know I, um, played Modern Warfare 3 with subs. I definitely want to do that with Black Ops 2, so maybe I can do that. I'd love to live stream it, and I know the Xbox 360, or, I don't know, maybe it's PS3 too, but I know with Black Ops 2 you can live stream straight from your Xbox, but I think it has to be the League Play. So has anybody done this or seen it where people are doing the League Play and they're live streaming? Like, I, think, I feel like that would be fun, but, you know, I might only be able to play with like five other people, it has to be the same team, so... If anyone knows anything about it, please let me know. Man, my voice is like shaking because the car is bumping. <sighs> Uncomfortable? <laughs> I thought I'd throw a little pause in there to, uh, you know, make sure you're listening. Okay, we only have one other question. We didn't have a lot of questions today. Um, I sent out I sent out the tweet kind of earlier today. Maybe that, that's what's going on. But um, anyway, it was I write light, and um, he just said he wanted to know what kind of iPhone apps I just can't live without, or what I usually use if I play any games or anything. You know, I used to play Angry Birds and uh, Tiny Wings when those were. I don't know, early on when I got my iPhone 4, really. Ever since then, though, I haven't played much um, games on my iPhone. The things I use the most, 
maps. I use maps all the time. Um, Evernote. I just started using Evernote for my notes because I'm constantly, whenever I have any YouTube ideas, I, I'm going to forget them, so I throw them in my phone. Grocery list stuff, Christmas list stuff, any type of idea, I throw it in Evernote. It's pretty cool. And it, it, uh, it crosses devices too, so I can look that stuff up on my computer. Pretty cool. Twitter, of course, Facebook, um, what else? My action movie effects, of course, for this. This new app could be a new one that I require, this YouTube uh, capture app. And, yeah, that's mostly the apps I use. That's about it. But um, maybe put in the comments what, what do you guys like. Um, I do want to get some feedback from you guys. So, you know, let me know what kind of apps you like. And, uh, you know, if you don't have an iPhone, if you have a different kind of phone, what apps you like on that. And um, I want to get some feedback from you guys as far as, um, you know, what you think would be a fun idea to do for like a Christmas video or something. I already have an idea. I mentioned this in another video, but what do you think? You know, I want to. I want to involve everybody, but it's tough to involve seven thousand people. So, I'm still thinking. I got some ideas, but we're almost at Christmas already. So, oh, notification. Got it. But anyway, guys, we're at seven hundred and twenty seconds. So divide that by sixty, and you know, we're getting. Uh, we're getting long on this video. <laughs> um, but, oh, one last thing. One last thing. Every, you know, I see a lot of people complaining about the new YouTube layout. I was pretty ticked about it at first. But, you know, it's not turning out too bad. I'm getting, you know, about the same amount of subscriber base and all that kind of stuff. Like, the views are down, but I don't... I, I wonder if... Whoa! <laughs> Cup just hit my car. Um, but I wonder if the views are accurate or not. You know how the views get a little funky sometimes? But, you know, if the views are right, you know, everyone's views are kind of down. So I just want to get an idea, what is the best way for you guys to see my videos? Would you prefer me to notify you more on Twitter? Or um, maybe I'll get a Facebook account? Would that be easier for you guys to like, you know, see I post a video on Facebook and be like, oh, there it is. Or, you know, what do you guys like to do on YouTube? Do you go to the subscription page and you just do the flat out homepage and do the recommended thing? Um, so yeah, give me a little feedback there. Um, but yeah, guys, if you don't already, follow me on the Tweety Bird website, Twitter. And if you like the video, feel free to like feel free to subscribe, whatever you want to do, um, but yeah, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later.